he risked and ultimately gave his life for two complete strangers that were in need. But first, a tragic update after a father, son, and a good Samaritan swept away in the waters off Apollo Beach. Investigators believe they have recovered the body of the man who's being called a hero. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Jamison Euler. Wendy has the night off. Deputies say Christoph Murray jumped into the water to try to save that father and son. And now we know all three did not survive. ABC Action News reporter Ryan Smith is in Apollo Beach with the community's efforts to support two grieving families tonight. This certainly isn't the outcome that any of us wanted. A hero who sprung into action, his sacrifice honored. To the Murray family, your husband, your brother, his actions were nothing less than heroic. He risked and ultimately gave his life for two complete strangers that were in need. Christoph Murray's family prayed for a miracle all weekend. We're told the 27 year old did not hesitate, jumping into the unforgiving choppy water off Apollo Beach in a desperate attempt to rescue two strangers. Janash Purikal and his three-year-old son, Daniel, who were swept away by a rip current Friday night. It's awful because one day completely changed his wife's life, you know, um, you know from having his a son and a husband to having neither one. Nick Gennaro lives next door to the family. Their children played together daily. Isabella still wanders to the shared fence thinking about Daniel. He's my best friend. I miss him so much. I really do. And you I really re miss him, huh? Yeah, and I really love him too. The Gennaros are now collecting cards, letters, and money to help both families impacted. Operation Lotus, a Lithia-based nonprofit, is also collecting donations. When we see a need like this, we need to just reach out. We need to reach out. The nature preserve remains closed to the public. I'm told it will likely reopen by the end of this week. Meantime, Sheriff Cronister tells me the county is now eyeing additional safety measures here to make sure something like this never happens again. In Apollo Beach, Ryan Smith, ABC Action News.